Welcome. Today I will present Retriever, an approach for point cloud based place recognition on compressed 3D maps. Place recognition is an important block for many robotic systems. A pre recorded global 3D map allows vehicles to localize by comparing the current local surrounding with the given map. Other use cases are SLAM systems, which often require to detect loop closures to deal with the drift and to create consistent maps. For this, you compare the current location with the previous visited ones. The scalability of such systems is often limited by the huge amount of memory for large-scale maps. Let's assume we want to create a 3D map for Philadelphia, in which we can later localize in. We store every 10 meter a common LiDAR point cloud, in which requires around 1.6 megabytes per scan, which sums up to 663 gigabytes for all the streets in Philadelphia and by this we covered only one city. To deal with this problem, compression could provide an efficient way to substantially decrease the memory footprint. But for now it is rarely investigated in how the compression affects the performance of downstream tasks. To this end, we propose a place recognition approach which works directly on a compressed point cloud representation. For our approach, the map representation are the local point clouds around some key poses. As a pre-processing step, we compress the point clouds using a compression network. The compressed representation can then be used for efficient storage, transmission or by our retriever network for place recognition. For each key pose, we can compute one descriptor vector which captures the characteristics of the point cloud. In the end, the collection of all the descriptors with an associated global pose serves as our database. For the online operation, we can use the same methodology and first compress the point clouds of the current location, which then serves as input for the retriever to recreate the descriptor. We can then compute the similarity between our current query location to the pre-recorded areas in the database on a descriptor level. Our proposed architecture is divided into two parts. The compression network to extract the compact representation and to reconstruct the input as well as the retriever to extract the descriptors from the compact point cloud. For the compression network, we use our previous work, which is a convolutional autoencoder that can be trained in a self-supervised fashion. The bottleneck representation consists of a very sparse, downsampled point cloud with features from which we can reconstruct the input. For the dense point clouds, the network achieves a compression ratio of around 1 to 100. For the feature aggregation, we propose the retriever, which operates on the compressed representation, namely points and features. Those are fed into a reduced point net to transform the compression-specific representation to features which are better suited for place recognition. For the aggregation of the local features, we utilize a perceiver-based network. The perceiver bypasses compute heavy and memory-consuming self-attention on the input by introducing a smaller latent representation. These latent vectors will be used in our approach as a reference context for the feature aggregation. Each latent vector aggregates information from the input point cloud. In the end, a fully connected layer projects the latent features to the desired descriptor dimension. In this work, we have proposed a network for point cloud-based place recognition which directly operates on a compressed map. We are all able to reliably retrieve our position without the need for decompression. Our proposed perceiver-based aggregation module is able to generate global descriptors to compare point clouds. Even though we are working on a compressed representation, we achieve a 17% higher recall than the most similar baseline. Thank you very much for your attention.